It gives me great pleasure to be here tonight to induct Paul McCartney into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, America. Thank you, Neil. I love Neil. Okay. Well, unlike those other guys, I haven't got a speech. So this should be fun. I'm making it up. Um, yeah, man, well, here we are in the Waldorf Hotel in New York. And, uh, you know, this is, like, brilliant for me. It's brilliant stroke sad, of course, because, um, you know, I would like my baby to share this with me. She wanted this. Uh, yeah. Um, but it's beautiful, you know, she's beautiful, it's all beautiful, and we're cool. So, um, I'll tell you what I want to do, actually. I want to get my date up here, my date for this evening. I want to call her up. Come on, baby, come and share this with me. It's my little baby, Stella. Come on. Get up here. And she didn't know I was going to do this, so she's going to be highly embarrassed. But I don't care. A friend of ours had these baby booties on her, on her baby, and it said, 50% mommy, 50% daddy. Well, here she is. I like that. She doesn't give a shit, right? These young people, you know, they've just got no fear. Um, Okay, listen, so really what I just want to say, what, what we want to say is I love rock and roll because it made my life. Uh, by, by the way, while we're here, I mean, you got me, you got John in this. Okay, what about George and Ringo? Yeah. Come on, guys. Come on. I love rock and roll, I say. I, I love Cleveland. Because <laughs> Cleveland gave me Linda's mom, who was from Cleveland. All right. Yeah. Cleveland. And I love New York, because New York gave me Linda. So I want to say to you all, thank you very, very much. And uh, this one's for you, baby.